industry CFD, um, let's go back to 83, 85, maybe in early 90s when you started your professional career as a faculty member at Illinois, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. Were there any large industries doing CFD already back then, using CFD for their design? Absolutely. It's uh, interesting, uh, when I started as a young faculty, uh, it's always hard to get funding. Uh, so the, my first funding was from Schlumberger. Ah. So it's a well-known company and they were interested in uh, flow around uh, big, long rods, uh, um, tube banks. That was a very good uh, starting point. Then I extensively worked with heat transfer uh, uh, community. So they were interested in enhancing heat transfer using lowered fins, uh, fin and tube heat exchangers. It was a big uh, center where uh, it's, it's a NSF uh, IUCRC center uh, where uh, dozen faculty came in and interacted with dozen uh, industry. Modine, Westinghouse, a lot of different companies came and they were interested in increasing heat transfer performance on their uh, various uh, heat exchangers uh, and uh, uh, they came up with some problems and we tried to propose solutions. It was a great training bed for students. So they took on some real engineering problems and created some science out of it. They wrote their thesis and then they went and got employed as well. So that's how it started.